images of it on TV, on social media. But I think that um, experience is also important. When you see it, you, you go past buildings that are half submerged, those that are full submerged. You see windows where ordinary things are, like ordinary people live there, and yet they cannot access the place. I ask myself, I mean, so at the moment when they had to flee, if, for example, you're a mother with young children, what will you do? If there's one breastfeeding, the other not, you know, toddling, what do you do? Do you put one on your back? Do you carry the other one on your shoulder? Do you remember to take their medicine or their food? Do you yourself remember what you need to take with you at the time where you are so confused? How can you even think straight? And where are you going anyway? And who is receiving you? And, you know, it's just many things. And uh, if you're also very old or too old to move, and we like to keep our older people with us, which is a very good thing, what do you do? The person can't walk. And there's water higher than you know, the tallest person. So what, what at that moment, what do people do? You see, sometimes when we don't break the issues down to the human level, then we just feel it's something happening somewhere to some people. It can happen to anybody. And we all need to learn to be empathetic. We all need to learn to care, you know. All right.